How are you doing, fellas? Welcome back to Grim Fandango, one of my favorite playthroughs. Now, where were you? I really like. Look at the doggy pass. Even though this is a cat batting place. Um, what were we doing? We got a union card. I can't remember what this is. A, like a, a turkey baster. A key. RCL. Uh, that's the union card, I suppose. Metal detector. Alright, let's go. I think we've seen it all. Apparently, many can teleport. This place is spooky. It's locked. I have a key. Don't know what the key is for, but key. Select key. Ooh. All right. Can I get in, please? Okay. She's flowering. But he's never gonna find that thing. I'll get him, Lola. I'll show Max the picture for you and fix Nick for good. Just tell me where you hid it. Oh, Manny, it's all my fault. Always falling for the wrong guys. You know, I even had a thing to do <laughs> once. But you were so hard. Hey, I'm a good guy. Woman, I figured I didn't have a chance. Lola, where's the picture? Tell me, Manny, when I've had a chance. No. Never mind. You just want Olivia for me. Tell her to improve her taste in men, or she'll end up just like me. Tell her to get a nice guy, Manny. Oh, I will, Lola. 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 Mi espace tutti di bella. That's not Spanish. I don't even know Spanish or Italian. What was that? Can I pick it up? Oh. Hey, there's a picture of a tongue on it. And it says number 22. Lengua. 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 Tong. Tong. Hey, there's hey. a picture of a tongue on it. And it says number 22. Lengua. 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 Let's go Lengua, boys. Hey girl. I got something for you. Nope, that's my union card. There we go. Hey, this is a card for my new code check system. You do care. Can I have my code please? You bet. This is so exciting. Okay, okay. Oh, okay. Woohoo! Oh, okay. Twenty-two, twenty-two, twenty-two. Lengua, lengua, lengua. I like her. What's wrong? So full with energy. Lupe, what is it? What? Can't be yours. Maybe it is. What are you doing with a tiny girl jacket? I don't suppose. Ah. No. She must have hidden that somewhere else. I'll tell you tomorrow. Okay. Can I use it? Check it out. There's a little slip of paper in one of the pockets. Paper. What does the paper say, Manny? All that this paper says is number 36, the rusty anchor. What is that supposed to mean? What? Let me check it out. Let me check it out properly. All that this paper says is number 36, the rusty anchor. What is that supposed to mean? Evening, Lupe. Hi, Hi Lupe, Guadalupe. 
Okay. Maybe she knows what 36 to 30 alerty anchor means. I mean, it's is it place in the harbor or let's check this. Jacket. It's Lola's jacket. All that this paper says is number 36 the rusty yeah. anchor. What is rusty that supposed anchor. to mean? Oh. Please don't tell me you're Oh god. Whoa! Whoa! Manny! Holy Christ! I didn't know you could face Manny. Face through solid objects. That's a wonderful revelation. A blue casket. Uh, this was Viola, wasn't it? Well, Not another poem? Do you know anything about... about... There we go, no, going a little bit too fast, Manny! There we go. The rusty yes! Manny, I didn't know you were familiar with my early <sighs> work. I usually don't do the old stuff, but I'll swing this one just for you. All right. The wind pierces my hull. An iceberg, a needle, sweet, whispered nothings. Sail tonight, a storm. This deathbed harbor by love's rusty anchor forever moored. I'm not sure what that means. I don't know what it means. I'll never know what that means. This is dirty water. The sink is full of dirty hookah, hookah water. water. Hookah water. I got so many things, so many things, you know. Know what I'm saying? All right. That's interesting. Now. That was a bit exaggerated, Manny. Yo, hello. So, uh, ah, it was sad. I just like my mother. It was too short. It said nothing to me, like my father. <laughs> I had no feelings about it. It was aloof and licked it like my cat, Mr. Trotsky. All right. Hi, what's your name? Okay. Okay. Hey. When as noches, comrade. Hey, Manny. No. What makes you guys? You smell like. Okay. okay. Well, keep practicing. All right. All right. Great. I think we're in need of some help here. Some magic out of the air help. Help. Is it a tattoo shop? It looks a bit shady. Ah, oh, Manny, what are you doing? Oh, this is a tattoo shop. What? How come I didn't notice it? It's Toto Santos, Rubacava's friendly scrimshaw artist. Tattoos on bones, that must be... Weird. Hola, Toto. Como Como estas? Now, Manny, I'm in the middle of something with Naranya! That's Naranya! Alright! Why? He's. 
It's beefier than I thought for a skeleton. I really doubt I'll be a lot of stains for a guy with no bottle. Right. Fluids. Gross. It's empty. Yeah. If I took it, once I am done with Naranja here, I am going to tattoo big fingers <laughs> on the side of my head so people will know what a All right. you are. Now, hello, operator. Yeah, it's me, baby. How'd you know? Hey, don't say that, sweetheart. You know I meant to stop by. And... I'm more happy about leaving town every minute. What? I wonder if Inez has cooled off yet. Inez. Not picking that up. What am I doing here? What's this? It's empty. Yeah, I got to remember to get more liquid nitrogen from more. Liquid freeze the bones, less painful. Hey, that sounds good. I could go for that. You got plenty of painkiller in that bottle of yours, so shut up and hold still. It's attached pretty well. Can I pull the plug or something? Pull the plug. No. Not picking that up. What the heck is prepare? That's a prepare. Ah! Who is over there? All right. Oh, it was back there. Good for you. Oh, rest in peace. I killed someone. Oops. He's still alive. Me? I gave him the idea in first place. Ah, Tiger can't change his stripes. Can I do something? Can I kill him? Going? I'm not sure. Hey, listen to me. You got to take care of yourself. Uh, sailor? That's a good idea. Seaman and Selmo yeah, Naranja yeah, in yeah, yeah. third class. Doesn't look like you'll be showing up to work in the morning. Good idea. Mm -hmm. I already searched him pretty thoroughly. Sure. Doesn't look like you'll be showing up to work in Good. the morning. Good. Now let's 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 bail. Sure, of course, I understand. Before they find out it was me. Not that that would happen, but still. Definitely. And this is a pretty random thing. Ah, uh, hang on a second. This mean anything to you? You mean beside the song, the poem, and the bar, and the statue by that name? Sure, it is one of my most famous designs. Here I show you. Rusty Anchor, let's see. Let's see, uh, number 30, Harmin Sedge, Harmin Sketter, Harmin... Ah! 36. Here. Hey, what is this? I don't know. You tell me. What is it? 
I was afraid it was crashing again. My friend Lola left that here for me. Oh, oh yeah. Uh, Lola was here, sweet girl, like daughter to me. Tell her Papa Toto says well, she's hello. She's dead. Right. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, let's check it out first. All right. Looks like these cats are almost scruff and scruff. Well, <laughs> what's this cat doing? Holy shit. That's pretty scary. Not here. The cats are huge, humongous. Let's check that pig one more time. No. No. There we go. Jesus, the cats are humongous. Oh, marry me, Olivia. You see that? Wow. Where was the morgue? Pretty sure I know where it is. Just have to walk, 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 walk. And talk. Walk and talk. Yeah. This is it. The mark. Um, no, no, yes, Narana, Narana, not Narana. Are you sure you're looking hard enough? Look, Manuel, these old eyes are tired. I'm doing the best I can, but the average retirement age beachcomber has more sophisticated equipment than I've got. Well, here. I have something for you. No, 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 yay! Do you need this? There you go. Would a metal detector help the cause? Absolutely. Hey, just like downtown. Just like in the security you office, you mean? This will turn up an engraved ring, a belt buckle with somebody's name on it. Art tag, dog tag. <laughs> Who would wear a belt buckle with the. <laughs> Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Huh. That ain't right there. Lasco, it looks like I've got one of your boys down here in the morgue. A sailor by the name of Narana. Narancha. Orange, huh? How? Sprouted? But, oh, this town's going to hell. Sailor can't even take a two-day shore leave without watching his back. Yeah, yeah, I'll come down in the morning. No, you won't. That's no need. All day long, Manny, I sought through pure sadness. I find evidence, but none of my stories end well. Everyone's oh, dead. Yeah, and the moral of every story is the same. We may have years, we may have hours, but sooner or later, we push up flowers. You should also perform in the blue casket. I'll recommend you to Olivia. Sometime. Other than today. Uh, what did we manage? Nothing. No. Okay. That's possible as well. This way. It's one big giant circle though.
sprout it. What's happening? Uh, I know you probably hate getting it this way. No, Velasco, I don't know if I'm comfortable taking that. You'll take his job because there's no one else I can get on such short notice. And don't forget that Gladys has got to bring his own. He will. He doesn't go anywhere without a lot of tools. Good. Because neither does the limbo. Don't just sit around here collecting barnacles. Right. Barnacle boy! All right. Let's, let's get serious again and get... Get away from here. I hate looking through all my items. There we go. Use money. Use it. Um, I think it was six six. Do you say? Let me check. Why Tuesday though? Tuesday. Week 2. How do I know? It's a betting stub for, let's see, Tuesday. Week 2. Race 6. Okay. Let me check it out. Let me check it out. Just to be sure. Stub for let's see Tuesday week two race All six. Right. Is this uh let's talk to the dude? Anybody there? I told you we don't give out the kitty hats till Tuesday. Here. Oh, another Chowchilla Charlie original. Give me one good reason not to throw you out of here. Because I'll tell Max to fire you. <laughs> Wait. Anybody there? I told you. <laughs> Wait a minute. Uh, should I? Damn it. Is this the same guy? Oh, hi. Betting stop, please. Oh, I, I don't have. Oh, bye bye. Oh, well, God damn it. Why Tuesday, though? Hello. Hello. Come estas? Oh, hey. Hi. Betting stop, please. Here you go. This looks uh, it, it's thing. legit. Well, that's because it's from uh, last season. All right, just a second. <laughs> there you are. Thank you. Aha. What? Are you a winner? Big winner. <laughs> Thanks, pal. Glad I could help. Thanks, mate. No idea what that was, but... Ooh la la! It's Lola's last work. A juicy photo of Nick and Olivia kissing. I remember that. You marry me, Olivia? Now then. Bzz, bzz, bzz. Um... Don't you, Doug? <laughs> Doug? Doug? Are you okay? Oh, that guy? Personally, I think he was nuts. I think that guy has a split personality. That's what I think. Now. Do I? Okay. Let's uh, blackmail Nick yeah. if I can find him. You're doing it. Ah, he's at the table again. Nick, can you help me? Please, pretty bad, pretty bad, pretty bad. Look what I found at the photo finish booth. Looks like Naughty Kitten and Bad Tomcat are neck and neck. 
What do you want? I'll let you know when I think of it. Better. I know what I want. Hey, what do you want from me, Calavera? Mm, can't think of anything yet. Uh, I need a lawyer. Why do I need a lawyer? All right. Oh, hello. Can I talk to? Let's let's say for a second. Can I talk to the big boss? Why, if it ain't Manny Calavera, come to see how the big boys play. From what I can tell, they play. Kitties, roulette tables, they go round and round. All Look, you gotta cut. As long as he's got credit, then he's got no problem. Credit? How did Gladys get credit? He's part owner of your club, ain't he? Half owner, actually. Well, he put the joint up as collateral. So as long as you're in business, he's in business. God damn it, Gladys. What else do you have to say, Max? You know you you got a good not as nice. Did you say hey Manny, don't pretend it's not a secret anymore. Olivia and I are officially. Oh, wow. No. How's your well volume's pretty tell me but I've got some side business. What happens if I do say so? Well, uh, Manny. We were all one big family. No, I'm many. Oh, Nick Virago's been my trusted counsel for years. You shouldn't even joke around about their character like that. It could make me very. I'm that's enough God. now. <laughs> I'm here. <laughs> 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 Decided not to let what happened to the Olivia one. Imagine it goes and crashes, explodes and burns on your own track. It kills your favorite cat too. Not the kind of thing. Oh. Well. Well. Enough talking. Let's let's get out of here, Gladys. Stop betting all my money, please. Go in, Manny. Get in there. Hello, Lupe. Manny, what the hell are you doing? That's my desk. How about there? I haven't checked that one. I thought this. I should have checked this. Apparently not. Oh my, my god. My communications from Salvador. He's been sending me messages like this for the last year. Agent Calavera, I have word that you arrived in Rubacaba safely. This is great news, as your service to the LSA may now continue. I am pleased to report the successful hatching of the eggs you liberated. The hatchlings, which Eva has named Manny and Cute. Mitchell, are quite Aww. happy and eager to serve our cause. Manny and With luck, my next letter will be born to you across the sky by these young gossamer wings of truth. For the revolution, Salvador Lima. Viva la revolution. I'm not done reading it yet, but maybe later. That's cool. I mean, I should have gotten this in the very beginning, but still. Here we go. Calavera, it is indeed a great day for the revolution. Say hola to little Manny, the first enlisted messenger to serve the LSA. Please feed him some breadcrumbs and send him back quickly. So we may know that our maiden flight was a success. It's cute. It's really cute that they call him Manny Ameche. I dig it. Hello, communists. Hello. Hola. Oh. All right. I need that book, gentlemen. I need it. Guys, check this out. Hey, 
did I ever tell you guys that you remind me of my friend Salvador? Salvador. Salvador Limones is a fairy tale, a spook story. The man tells the masses as he puts them to sleep. Idiot. Salvador Limones is a very real and a very great, great man. He also writes a mean letter. What is this? I, Salvador Limones, salute you, Manuel. Calabria. Si, gentlemen. In this noble revolution, you really know Salvador Limones? What's he like? Why didn't you tell us you were a freedom fighter? You wouldn't believe me. I can't talk about my underground gig, man, where I put the whole scene in Dangerville. Wow. Brad, it's heavy. I've got a split, so, um. Viva la revolution. Man. Viva la revolution. Would you guys mind if I dug on this book for a while? Knock yourself out, brother. Bro, brother's here. Finally progress, ladies and gents. Ah, good stuff, good stuff. You guys need this. Time for revolution, boys. Stand up to the union. I think these are the words you're looking for. The workers shall control the means of production. The workers shall control the means of production. Yes, that's it. That's what I've been trying to say. Good by you. Who will stop the fat cats of industry from building these ships with the pollen of the exploited working class? Maybe a bee agitator? I say lay down your tools right now and show the man just <laughs> the honey around. The bees. They're endangered now. Shake that bun. Honey bun. A honey bun. But you look all red to me, my friend. Ah! Hey, what are you doing? We've got the right to assemble people. True. Good. You're going to need a lot of assembly after we take you apart, comrade. Betty! Get me a lawyer! Get me a lawyer! <laughs> That's going to make it tough to spring the kid and get him back out here. Good thing I know a lawyer who owes me a favor. Good thing indeed, Nick. Let's go. High Rollers Club, if I recall correctly. Yep, yep, yep. Here. I suppose what here? A little more money. Still don't know what a lever does. Probably tried it, but still. Ah, uh, the super high rollers club. Let's go. Kitty kitties. Almost there. You're doing it. So, Nick. Pretty bad, pretty bad, pretty bad, pretty bad. It's time to help me out. Tell you a sad story of a young man unjustly imprisoned merely for speaking his mind. It's time to shake up the hive. I guess our business is settled. Almost. Ooh. Oh, man. What was that for the photo, girl? No, that was just for being you. I don't have time to get you for Lola. But I'm sure somebody will. You didn't have time to save her either. But Pretty don't sure. feel too bad about that, Manny. I hear saving women really isn't your forte. Hey, I'm doing my best to fight Matcha and you know it. Nick. Nick Dick. Hmm. Okay. 
So, what was that all about? I mean, what's the point of me revolutionizing the the bees, the bees, inspiring the bees, the birds and the bees? Oh well. Check out the other desk. Should I operate it on eight though? Rien ne va plus, eh? Can get it on zero. Pleasure sont fait. Ladies and gentlemen, betting is closed. No more bets, please. Oh, did I do something now? What the heck? Fourteen. Fourteen is the winner. Le 14. Numero 14. I no idea what I was doing. I think you mean two. Am I correct? Uh, no, monsieur. Fourteen is the winner. I think you've made a mistake. I'm sorry, sir. Fourteen is the winning number. Better luck next time, eh? That does it! That calaver is getting too big for his britches. I don't like raiding businesses and shutting them down. But someone's got to teach Manuel a lesson in law and order. Sorry, I don't watch law and order. Open those paddy wagons up and start killing them. And somebody find Calavera. I want to interrogate him. Personally. You're just a bad loser. Raided. How long are they gonna close it for? Ah, yeah, you better cut off the big guy's credit then. Yeah, yeah, throw the drunk out on this big orange butt. And bring me Calavera so we can talk about his debt. Hey, come on! You gotta let me You can have my hotel. I'm a Gladys! Come on. Did that stand for very inebriated Very inebriated penis. I don't, wanna be I don't know what inebriated means, but... I'm a mechanic. I know. That's why I got you a new job. Come on, let's go pick up your tools. And I can do whatever I want to the engine? Make it faster? Sure, but you'll be plenty busy just keeping her afloat. Thanks for the gig. And for not asking too many questions. Hell, after what happened in Naranja, I right. see why you'd leave town. Not my fault. Let's just hope I don't have to go fishing you out of the drink again. I'll stay under next time. I promise. Finally, guys. Made it out of this Rubakava one year later again. Oh my god, Gladys, what have you done to the boat? <laughs> ah, that's awesome. Bit my boat. Captain Manny. Yes. Puerto Zapato, sailor. We're here at last. You Zapato. Board, didn't she? Yes, sir. Well, there's some customs officials down below, sir. They want to search the ship. Fine, fine. We've got nothing to well. hide, eh? No skeletons in our closet. <laughs> yes, sir. Good joke. Secure the bow, boys. Like a rock this time. Manuel oh my God! <laughs> It's a bird. It's one of the birds. Zapato says Miss Colomar never made it to the port. It said she threw herself overboard at the pearl. I don't know if you believe that. Whatever you do, do not land in Puerto Zapato. It's a trap. Assassins will attempt to board your ship disguised. Oh my God! Beware! And viva la revolución! These birds are. Damn. Well, assassins on my ship. 
Good deal. But that's it for today. That's it for every day. We'll deal with the assassins the next time. And I'll see you then. It was a great journey. Rubakawa was kind of confusing, but it was a lot of fun. Thank you for watching. See you the next time. Bye bye. Bye bye.